Father God, that that, that this biologic and germ warfare and diseases, Father, you know, Father God, oh, if it was only a bullet that seeks to take the lives, Father God. But Lord God, there's so many ways to die. And Father, you know the evil ones, God. You know the way they torture, Father God. You know the way they want to someone to suffer. You know Halloween's coming up, Father. You know that it's a satanic day, that they, that's a higher unholy time, Father. There's nothing holy about that day. It's the most unholy time, Father. But you said, Lord God, you said, Father God, that every day, Father God, that, that we are to rejoice and we are to know that it is you, it is you that wakes us up each day, Father. It is you that gives us the strength, Father God, to go on. And so we thank you, we praise you, because you know what? We only need one rock in our hand to slay Goliath. That's what you're telling me right now. We need one rock in our hand to slay Goliath, and that is the living rock. That is the living rock, and we have the living rock, and we hang on to the living rock. And it is you, Yeshua HaMashiach. You are the living rock. You are the cleft of the ages. And we just give you the praise, honor, and glory right now. For you will protect your people. And you will be used to slay this Goliath that comes against us. They think they're going to slay all those that believe and trust in Yahshua HaMashiach and, and you, Father God, Yahweh. But they have a root of awakening. For Goliath came to David, too, and he called him a dog. And yet, what did David say back to him? This day! the God that I serve is going to deliver your head into my hands. So, Father, I cry out for all the Christians. Father, for the Pakistan minister, Father, that we're going to have to post his wife's plea that thinks we have some way to be able to get a message to, to, to George W. Bush that if he's going to listen to us, Father. But, Lord God, she's there, Father God, and she's in Pakistan, Father, and her husband and her and all the Christians, Father God. Well, Lord, these evil Muslims, Father God, that we can't even call evil because I suppose you're going to accuse a, uh, a hate crime if we would do, do that, Lord. But, Father God, they're in terror, and they're hiding in their houses, and the Christians are being slaughtered all over, Father. Just because in America we sat here, God, and we didn't see this. Oh, forgive us, God, as we closed our eyes to what was going on around the world. For now it's hit home, Father God, and we see the danger in our own land. But, Heavenly Father, I cry out right now. I ask right now, Lindy agrees with me, to start the mirage of angels from heaven. Dispatch the mirage, the veins of the warring angels, of legions upon legions of legions to go forth into this world right now, to protect your children right now, to protect those that cry out in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, to cry out in the name of Yahweh. Protect them, protect them, protect them. Oh, I thank you and I praise you for the domes, the domes that are over all the houses, Father, who belong to you. Not just on the doorpost, God. Not just on any old lamb's blood. No, this is the Lamb of God, Yahweh. This is the holy, unblemished, spotless Lamb that was slain for us and arose again. This is you, Yahshua HaMashiach. You are the one that covers and protects our homes. We give you the praise, honor, and glory. Not just for Wendy and I, but for all my brothers and sisters around the whole world. I know you will have martyrs, but I praise you and I thank you, God, that you will have more that you will protect and more that will die in your name. I believe in faith, Father God, for how can the enemy say that we are different than anyone else that gets slaughtered, Father, if you do not show the kind of miracles you did in the times with the children of Israel, when the evil Pharaoh chased them, if you do not show, Father God, when, when back in the times of old, Father God, again and again, you prove when Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego was thrown in a fiery furnace and Daniel in the lion's den, Oh, hallelujah, Father God. We praise you. We thank you. The same God that spit Jonah out of the mouth of a whale, belly of a whale. You're the same God, Father, that, that Noah and his family were spared when everyone in the whole world died. You're the same God, Father, that did all of these things, even though the waters and covered the entire world, Father God, if the Mississippi River is going to overflow, and all these horrible things, God, and I'm told, Lord, the very states will be underneath it, Father, and Lord, I just give you the praise, honor, and glory, you got an ark, you had an ark for Noah, you'll have an ark for your children, 
for you. Oh my God, yeah. We see the enemy troops stand all around our, the, the, what is to be our wedding day. Kaina Kasama Katana Sabuto Magatia. Where is our groom? Sabuto Magatia. We see the guns pointed at us. Sikara Makatana Sakatana Sokosu Nakotia. We see the grins on their faces. Sikatana Katoma Magatina Katina. They think they're surely going to kill us. Sikara Kasana Katana Sokosu Nakotia. To wipe us from the human race. Katia, that you did what you said. 
said you would do, Kotoma Katina Katina Gainantia, that very day, Kamakariyama, Katina Katina Kotoma Kotoma Katina Katia. So let us have the heads of the enemies, Ikanama Katina Kotoma Katina Katia, just as surely as the enemy took that of John the Baptist, Kotoma Katina 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 Katia. Let us cut off the heads of Goliath, Kotoma Katina 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 Katia, for the sword of the double edged. For now you know I have a new vision. I look and lo and what do I see? Pakaina Katana Katina Kadana Soma Katina Katia. But the double edged sword, Kotoma Katina Katia, is in every bright hand. So Kosana Kotoma Kina Katanda, Pakara Namaina Kasana Katina Kosana Kotia, and on the very blade, Pakosana Kotina Katia, I see it's been dipped in blood, Kotona Kotoma Katina Katanda Sana Katanda Sakosana Kotia, but it's the blood of Yashua Hamashak, the Kosana Kotima Katina Katia, that protects us with that sword, Kotoma Kayina Katana Mata Kayama Kotoma Katia. I see us, we swing it to the left and to the right, Kotoma Katina Katana, and the enemy strikes. Send the Kotoma Kaina Katana to Kosono Kotoma Katina Katia, Pakara Namayana Katana Katana Samagatia. But now they know they come not against the Kosono Magatia, not just any woman or man. So Kosono Kotoma Katina Katina Kaya Katana, so Kosono Kotoma Katina Katana Katana Sahina Kati, Pakara Namayana Katana Katana, so Kosono Katina Katana, so Kosono Kotia. So that's what we're going to do, so Komagatia Magatia, as we wait for you on this wedding day, Pakara Namayana Katana Katana, so Kosono Kotoma. We're just going to continue to fight in your holy and your righteous and your anointed Joshua name. We just say we just don't wear any wedding gowns, but we stand in the full armor of God, Yahweh. And now I not only see the enemies running away, but I see the angels, legions of the legions of angels, that you have sent this very day while I pray, they are the ones. They call the enemies that run in seven different road directions. And so we'll stand here, so Kosna Katina Katina Katia. For your word says when you've done everything you can do, you just stand, because Oma Katina Katia. And so we'll stand here, Pakayana Katana Katina Katina Omakia. For Kosana Kotina Kayana Tanda, and we'll wait for our groom. No matter how long it takes, we know you're never too early nor too late. So we're going to stand here, Kotoma Katina Katia. We're not even going to fall asleep. We're not even going to sit down, Kotoma Katina Katina Katia. We're going to stand our ground. Kotoma Katina Katia. So they laugh and mock. Kotoma Katina 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 Sagatia. We're going to stand here, Koma Katina Katia, and wait for our groom who is called the Living Rock. Keep a Kayina Katina Katanda. Pokohoda Mahina Katina Katina Katia. And although we've got the tears, Kayin Katina Katia. Also Kosana Kotia. And although we still battle the fears, Kosana Kotina Katanda Pakayina Katana Katanda. Also, because no matter how many years, we're going to stand here with the oil in our lanterns and with the whip and we're going to stand here and wait for our groom who 
our beloved come. He pakaina kasina katanda sukusina kotoa kotohoma haina katina katina katia. We love you. We love you. We worship. We adore you. Sukusina kotoma katia. Our heart wouldn't even be if it wasn't for the fact that you caused it to. Sukusina kotoma katina katia. We long for you. We pant for you. Sukusina kotia. Like a person that thirsts in a desert. Thank you for your living water. But it cannot take away the thirst. That longs for you. That pants for you. That we weep. Where is our groom? Will you come real soon? Will it be today? Will you come and take your bride away? We're standing underneath the hoopla. And we're still looking in the north, south, east, and west. So we feel in such distress. Let us not just keep hearing the bad news. For let us remember in whose report do we believe. Instead, we're going to put our trust in the blessed hope and know that very soon with our groom, we will be caught up to meet him alive and we will be leaving oh so very, very, very soon. Thank you. Thank you, beloved Yeshua Hamashiach. Thank you for allowing me to speak for the bride this day. Thank you for hearing every one of our prayers. Oh, we worship you. We Praise you, we love you, we adore you, so We thank you for forgiving us of all of our sins and for never looking at them again. So the Katina Katana Sukos Nokotia. Pakara Namaina Katana Katana Sukos Nokoto. Koda Namakatina Katana Sakatana Sakatana Sukos Nokoto Kotomatia. Pakara Namaina Katana Katana Sukos Nokoto Makatia. Just let us hear your voice. Just let us hear your voice. Just lead us and guide us and tell us what to do is all we're asking of you. Let us not go before the cloud of glory. Let us not go behind it. Let us always be right under it. Use the pillar of fire, the 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 to light our way, let us never be in total darkness, but use a pillar of fire, when we can depend on electricity on that day. You'll be the one that wants us in the so we never get too cold. You'll be the one that cools us so we never get too hot. You'll be the one that feeds us. You'll be the one that we hold on to, the one we call the living rock. You'll be the arms we fall asleep in. You'll be the arms that hold us tight. You'll be the one that calms us when fear. Attacks us in the night. You'll be the peace that passes all understanding. When in this world we can find out. Oh, Father God, Yahweh, I call upon Yahshua, your only begotten Son. Please protect us. 
makatina katia Sandy Zebra One Iso kosu no kata makatina katanda Pakara na mai na kasu na katanda Iso kosu no kata makoto makoto makatia Pakara na makatia Let his prayer be a fit to stay Pakara na makasu na katia Iso kosu no kato makoto 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 Pakara na na kasu na katanda na katanda na katanda na kina and let the bride be encouraged in a special way. Let them feel your love. Let them know they're not forsaken. We only wait for you. Because we know you're going to come. For this world is not our home. Oh, we long for our heavenly home. But we're going to stay here and occupy. And accomplish the purpose that he sent us here for. Even though it means some shall live, some shall die. Even though it means some shall live, some shall die. パカラナマイナカサナカタナカサナカトコトマカティナカティナカサナソマティナカティナパカラナマイナカサナカタナソカサナカトマカティナカタナパカラナマイナカサナカタナソカサナカトマカティナカタナパカラナマイナカサナカ
Like a white is the nail polish. It's got all different colors in it. Oh, I love those kind of nail polish. You know, you can see all the different colors in it. Yeah, that's what you can see. Yeah. That's what it's doing. So, so people need to understand, and the men need to understand this. I'll tell you what, Michael. It, and, it, it, and what it is, it, it is <laughs> that men, that men who are called the bride always wonder, now how I'm going to look very sexy and bridal gown here, but all right, God, you call me a bride. But the Lord is doing this so the men can understand. It, it, it's a, the, the garment is something that makes good on the men and the women. Just the way that it fits us. It fits us different than it does the men because of the curves. You know, we're, we're shaped different, let's face it. But it's of the same material, and it's absolutely beautiful. And when the sunlight hits it, we just glow. And so I thank you, and I praise you. In fact, Wendy, you know what? I don't see it. Even though it may be dark outside. I don't even know what time. Yeah, it's after 9. It's 9.10, by the way. So I don't know what time that message started. But we really need to start remembering the time. Because it's 9.10 p.m. right now. And it's, uh, what date is it? What is, is this September? October. Is it? We're in October. Right? October 9th. We're not, we're in October 9th, and it's after 9 o'clock, and 9 is the number of deliverance from what I hear. Wow. Well, anyway, um, but anyway, the main thing is they, they need to understand that, and I think it's going to bless them to know that they're not going to stand there waiting in a, a flimsy white hiding coat. <laughs> it's the armor of God, and it's Ephesians 6. It is absolutely beautiful. I started saying, it is no night. Even though it's nighttime, there is no night. Well, I've seen the sun come down, and it hits that glowing. Uh, armor. So even though it may be night, and even though he comes in at midnight hour, and even though we're waiting around us, it will still be appear to be light. For we'll be able to see clearly when our brightness has come. That's what the Lord said. He said, this symbolizes though I come in the midnight hour, the light all around you is because you will not be caught in darkness. You will not be caught in the thief unaware. He said, you will have light all around you. Not depending on the daylight. But that's what the light is, the light of God. And as he comes closer, it only gets brighter. And you, as the Lord's new weapon that's going to be raised up in the enemy, he's telling me right now, is, is exactly this. We are going to see more clearly and have clearer revelation, clearer action, quicker work. We are having weapons that have been given to us. And I just, uh, this thing is brand new, this is, and no one's going to be able to stop this. For they'll try to take a lot of things away, but they can't stop hearing the voice of Yahweh. So the Lord's saying right now, to let the, let the people know, when they see these things come to pass, they're going to hear more clearly, see more clearly. For there appears to be darkness all around, in the midnight hour, really we are going to have the light of God anyway on that day. Okay. In the name of Yeshua. Amen. Okay.